Hey everyone, today we're diving into a quick comparison of two popular static site generators for documentation, DocuSaurus and MKDocs. Let's break them down and see what each one offers and see which one suits your needs best. First up, we have DocuSaurus. Developed by Meta, it's a JavaScript-based tool built on React, perfect for creating fast, single-page application-style documentation sites. It's got a modern design system with easy customization through themes and a rich plugin ecosystem for features like internalization and analytics. DocuSaurus shines for large, complex projects supporting versioning, built-in search with Algolia, and MDX for interactive components. It's ideal if you're already using React or need a dynamic, feature-packed site. Now, now, MKDocs. This Python-based static site generator is all about simplicity and speed. You write in Markdown, configure with a single YAML file, and get a clean static HTML site. With themes like Material for MKDocs, it's highly customizable and great for straightforward documentation. It integrates well with Git for version control, but lacks built-in search, requiring plugins for advanced features. MKDoc is perfect for smaller projects or those who want a lightweight, easy-to-use tool. So, how do they stack up? DocuSaurus is better for large-scale interactive documentation with robust plugins and React integration. MKDocs excels for simple, lightweight projects with minimal setup. If you need versioning and dynamic features, go DocuSaurus. And for quick, clean docs and Python familiarity, MKDocs is your pick. Check out this comparison chart for a quick review. That's it, guys. DocuSaurus for feature-rich dynamic sites, MKDocs for simple, fast setups. Choose based on your project size and team's tech stack. Like and subscribe for more tech comparisons, and I'll see you in the next video.